we formed the California Stem Cell Treatment Center so that we could do investigational studies on a lot of people and see how these cells could work and also see that they don't cause any injury. This is the first multi-specialty center of its kind in the United States and there are centers just like this across the globe. It's called the Cell Surgical Network. Doctors surgically derived cells separated from fat rich in stem cells to treat patients. One of the very large differences between our group and the stem cell centers that you find overseas is that we focus on autologous cells, which means your own cells derived from your own fat, as opposed to cells that may be from umbilical cord or placenta or bone marrow or different donors. And the autologous cells cannot transmit viruses or have immunologic stimulation to create an immune response because they're from your own body. Doctors at other centers have used bone marrow as a source of stem cells, but at these centers, liposuction fat is used. This is not only a much more minimally invasive procedure, takes less than 10 minutes to perform, but it also yields many more cells per treatment. The entire process takes around two hours. The adult cells rich in stem cells are deployed back into the body to treat a whole host of conditions including degenerative orthopedic problems, cardiopulmonary diseases, and neurological disorders. Besides our vision of having stem cell based therapies available everywhere, we also have the personal goal of wanting to do research, teach the public, and teach other physicians everything we've learned. The procedure is not yet FDA approved, but doctors are making advances every day. We use the Institutional Review Board to govern our research efforts. Uh, we have a clinical research coordinator that carefully follows all of our data. We have a university quality database that collects all of our data from all of our centers and from all of the work we do. And we're very meticulous about this data. And it's very important that this is all collected. I don't think there's very many centers that have our quality physicians, our quality technology, our closed surgical system. We have this idea that Stem cells shouldn't be something that you go to Russia for for $100,000 or that you, you know, buy out of a bottle from Big Pharma, but more that something that you can get in every community on every street corner from your physician and they're readily available and you can use your own cells to help yourself.